Hey guys. Okay. So in my last video, I bleached my roots and I did a bleach bath to try and take out most of this green. So I'm going to try a couple other methods to get this out because if you follow me on my Instagram, you would see that a few months back, I had a poll of whether I should dye my hair green or red and it was pretty close to being a tie and I think there was like one person who decided on green and it just turned out that the majority voted on the green so I did say that because it was such a close call that I would do the red next so I did order the red and it is on its way it should be here in actually it should be here tomorrow so I'm not going to dye my hair tomorrow unless I can get most of this out because if I were just to slap the red color on top of the green it would turn brown and my roots would be like bright red so that would be not a good look so I've done some research on some things that I can try to remove the hair color some of them are kind of weird some of them are just stuff that I've done before. So I'm gonna go ahead and try something that I have not tried before. As you can tell by the title, it, uh, you already know what I'm gonna do, but I am going to be using ketchup. <laughs> this is gonna smell so bad. Although it's not the worst thing I've ever put in my hair because there was something called, um, oh, Pravana Hair Color Extractor and it actually takes out or took out hair dye that you would mix with peroxide or developer like it, it doesn't take out direct dyes but it takes out this is not for my hair this is for my eyebrows it takes out dyes like this like you have to mix and it does not take out direct dyes anyway I'm just rambling that's discontinued I don't know if some of you know me from those videos of me using that but yeah it smelled like rotten eggs and it would not come out of my hair until probably like 10 washes like it just smelled so bad it worked great but it smelled disgusting I think there's other products out there that smell like that anyway anyway so I'm going to be putting the ketchup <laughs> Just on the green parts, I'm going to, of course, keep it out of my my roots. Uh, okay, so I really, really, really don't think this is gonna work, but I mean, I'm gonna try anything I can to get this green out, because it was really hard to get out before. I'm gonna smell like a french fry. You don't need to do it this way, you can probably just slap it back on, or slip, just slap it all on your head, but... Uh, why do I always end up putting food in my hair? <laughs> so I don't know exactly how this is supposed to work. I think that the red is supposed to neutralize the green, but I'm hoping it doesn't like make it brown. It is my only concern. I mean, I don't think ketchup actually dyes your hair, but I really don't know what I'm doing. This is worse than dyeing my hair. Oh my God, what am I doing? Oh, and I went to the store because I've been out of shower caps. I keep forgetting to get them. And all I had was a reusable one. And there's no way I want a reusable one having ketchup in it. I'm putting ketchup in my hair. What does my life come to? You know, there's some weird things that just work, so I'm just gonna go with it. Oh, that smells so bad. So if you're wondering what one if you're wondering what hair dye I used, it was Phantom Green by Arctic Fox. And I really, really like the color. I thought it was really pretty. I just get to the point where like it's time to bleach my roots and every couple months I just want to change my hair and you know put ketchup in it because that's normal right I really hope some at least something that I try works so it'll be worth it to be doing something so gross I've done red before but I've never done arctic foxes red and my goal is to try every single color by arctic fox so that I can just see, I don't know, I just wanna try every single color. Weird goals, I have really weird goals, but I really liked 
the, um, what was it, the ele electric peach. That was a lot of fun. I was so thrilled with that. And then of course the phantom green was awesome. I think those are the only colors that I've tried so far. I mainly went with Pravana before, and I like Pravana. I just feel like Arctic Fox is, it got more of a selection. In seven more minutes, I'm gone. I'm gone, I'm gone, I'm gone. In seven more minutes, I'm gone. as long as possible Ooh, it really stinks and it's like all over the back of my neck so I'm gonna go get cleaned up and I'll be back I, I will try and show you before I get in the shower because I don't really know how this is supposed to work I don't know if it's supposed to like dye or remove or neutralize um, I know that a lot of people that have blonde hair or lighter hair or I mean even I, I don't know but during the summer or okay when people swim in swimming pools it sometimes dyes their hair green or turns their hair green because of the chemicals and so this is one of those things that removes the green so I don't know if it will work for hair dye but I figured it was worth a shot it's better than doing another bleach bath which if these other things do not work I'm going to do a bleach bath but like I said I'm trying to do the non-damaging things before I go and slap another thing of bleach baths on my hair because I've been doing bleach baths for a while and it's only a matter of time before my hair turns into spaghettios so ew <laughs> there's ketchup in my hair anyway so I will be back to show you what it looks like right before I get into the shower okay guys so it's been sitting in my hair for like a little bit over an hour and one of the things that um, crossed my mind is how I'm going to wash this out. So um, I'm going to be using some dish soap because for one there's like food, there's the sauce <laughs> in my hair. So I really want to make sure to get it out and this is very um, cleansing. <laughs> so. Yeah, I don't know. I just thought that I would go ahead and let you guys know that this is what I plan on using to wash it out. I'm probably going to wash it a couple times with the dish soap and then I'm going to go through with my normal shampoo and conditioner. And then once it's dry, probably tomorrow because I let my hair air dry, um, I'll show you whether it did or did not work. So um, I'm going to go ahead and take this out I still see the green so I don't know if it's going to wash out with um, the shampoo or you know like I said this is just oh it smells <laughs> this is just an experiment to see if it works or if it doesn't work and if it does not work then I'm going to come back in another video and try something else so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and wash this out and I will see you guys when I come back probably tomorrow <laughs> It faded quite a bit, like it actually worked pretty well. I don't know if it was more the ketchup or if it was more of the dish soap because I washed it three times while I was in the shower just to make sure I got it all out because I didn't want to smell like a freaking french fry. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna try this one more time and see how it works out. 
and then I'm going to move on to something else. Just because of how much it faded, I don't know if I have to get absolutely all of the green out to do the next color that I'm doing, but I don't want to just jump in and then be like, oh yeah, it's fine, it'll probably work, and then see that it turns like a weird brown color or something. Because I mean, then I'd end up with like hot roots and a weird brown color. And that's just not the color I'm looking for. If it's something that someone else wants to do, that's great, but it's just not what I want. So I'm going to go ahead and apply more ketchup and then wash it out. And then hopefully, maybe tomorrow or the next day, I will show you the result and then kind of tell you what I think. So I'm gonna get started. Okay guys, so this is the third time I went through with doing the ketchup with cleaning it with the dishwashing dishwashing with the dish soap so I feel like I did a pretty good job I'm actually kind of impressed but I only said that I was going to do it a few times because I wanted to try some other things that I haven't tried before so hopefully the next video I will have all the green completely taken out and then I can do a video of me putting the red in my hair which I am so excited about. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And also, if you want to watch more videos like this of me putting random stuff in my hair <laughs> or just watching me dye my hair different colors, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And also, do not forget to hit that notification bell. So anytime I post a new video, you will be notified. Thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time. It's bye. Something in me that says it's fine. Hoping you wouldn't change me. Got the same old thoughts be my referee. I will be alright. Never cut it by.